It's Friday, June 11th here at the Dollar Tree. Today is the official day that they released the DVDs. That's not always set in stone. Sometimes it's a little off. They put them out late, they put them out early, but hopefully this store has some. So if you've been following my channel, you know I've bought a lot of Dollar Tree DVDs over the last week. Uh, so I'm not gonna be picking up a ton unless it's something uh, unique. This store did have some. Uh, Run for High Country, Apparition, Automation. But I looked these up and they have really bad reviews, so I'm gonna pass on those. Did find Trick and Skin Trade, but I bought those in the past. Let's go to the next Dollar Tree. So at the next spot, I was very surprised to find this one, American Outlaws. It's always funny when you find one of these in the old style case, the snap case, that's like 20 years old. Hmm, I'll definitely grab that one for a buck. We got more that we've already found in the last videos. Nature Calls, Sushi Girl Skin Trade, Ninja 1 and 2 Blu-ray, Survival of the Dead, this one without the slip cover, God bless America. I don't think I've ever found this one, The Reader, but I'll pass on that, not really my thing. But I have found these before, The Protector 2, John Dies at the End, American Violence in Order of Disappearance. I've never found this one on Blu-ray, I'll probably pick this one up, Astronaut. And more of the same. In Wilmantic, Connecticut. Hopefully they have some good stuff. Never been to this one before. Woo, doggy! The Weekly Wow. Only have a small section. The weekly Wow is small. It's not really a Weekly Wow. It's more like a Weekly... Eh, eh, I guess. So yeah, nothing worth picking up at this one. Just more of stuff I've already found. I don't see this one very often, red versus blue. And we do have this one, the Pirates of Somalia, with this guy from Captain Phillips. He's in more pirate movies than Captain Jack Sparrow. What, what the heck is this guy doing with his arms? What was that? Uh, it's just, this is how I stretch. Huh. I can do it all the way. Have I met you before? Uh, yeah, I think uh, we uh, work together. You're the guy from the theater weirdos. Uh, yeah. Still in Wilmantic, Connecticut. Dollar Tree, that Planet Fitness down there. Used to be a huge Salvation Army thrift store. It's sad that about half of them have closed. Let's see what DVDs we can find. So they got them right up front for the weekly meh. More of the same stuff we've already found. But they did have the Steven Seagal 4 movie Blu-ray pack. I don't think I've ever seen this. And of the Dollar Tree movies, this one's kind of hard to find. Uh, you might be the killer. I did find it one time already though. Dollar Tree has these ice creams advertised on sale for a dollar and it's a pretty good deal and it says right there real ice cream which is funny that it even has to say that because you have to look a lot of things like this vanilla sandwiches and then it's artificially flavored vanilla frozen dairy dessert you think it would be ice cream but it's not I'm just trying to look out for my homies I'm in Manchester, Connecticut. You know the deal. Out here is t-shirts. This is a really huge store. Got a couple boxes hidden here. So nothing new. One more hidden box, maybe we'll have some luck. 
Now, Dollar Tree, you need your front table to be organized. It represents your entire store. Everything's in disarray. I actually did find these two awake. I don't think I'm gonna get it though. And this one, a film by Eric Stoltz of all people. And has this kid. He's in the newer vacation movie, which I've been meaning to see. I haven't seen that yet. He's also in a lot of television. He's in White Hot American Summer 10 years later. He was on an episode of Curb Your Enthusiasm. He's also in an underrated show I just started watching called The Righteous Gemstones. So I'll pick this one up, Class Rank. Awake actually has pretty good reviews, so I'll grab that too. We're at the Dollar Tree in East Hartford, Connecticut. And what's really cool is back here, you'll notice, go past the dumpsters. Look, a drive through That's so cool. I'm going to ask if they have space balls on DVD. Oh, rats, it doesn't look like it's open. drive through is closed. Oh, no. Oh, they must have sold a lot of DVDs today. It's all right. It's all right. Look at it. The two tabs being here. You're welcome. Do you know if you have any DVDs? DVDs? No, nope. whatever's out there, that's what we have. Okay, so it's like the front section, the Weekly Wild thing? Yeah. But it's just completely... the sign's out there, if the sign outside is the DVDs, uh -huh. then they'll put them out. But if we don't have... I don't think it's DVDs. Yeah, but it's just like the empty table. Oh, not yet. They'll put it out by tomorrow. Okay, thank you. Windsor, Connecticut. Dollar Tree. They got the Weekly Wow DVDs on display. They got their American flags, very patriotic. I'm actually born and raised in the United States. We got them right up front. They're in a cage here. So got them right up front here. They're in a cage within a cage. We gotta uncage these DVDs. So it looks like they just took the rack off the shelf and then put it right in this front bin. So this one has a good selection, but they are most of the same ones we've already found. Survival of the Dead with the slipcover, Hammer of the Gods. It's only my second time finding that one. Then we got these over here. But did overlook this one, Perfect Host, David Hyde Pierce. Says it's a dark comedy, fresh and jarringly funny. I'll definitely grab this one. I took a break from the Dollar Tree to ride this big swing. <clears throat> so we're here in Springfield, Massachusetts at our final Dollar Tree of the day. I hope they have something good or else it would be very anticlimactic. What's kind of neat is they have advertisements for two of my favorite movies, Rocky and Ace Ventura. They got a weekly wow, so ooh, please. Alright, they got a little selection here. It looks like it was heavily picked over. So it's mostly the same ones I've already found before. Another American Outlaws, Pult Sick Nurses. I don't think I've ever found this one before, but I'm gonna pass on that one. And John dies at the end in the eyes of my mother. So someone asked me to pick this up for them. The eyes of my mother. And I'll do that. I just hope they have something really good to trade. I am willing to trade. If you if you have something I need, don't go throwing me garbage. But uh, anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe. I make Dollar Tree videos all the time. I make other videos, movie reviews, all sorts of stuff, thrift store videos, flea market videos. And uh, yeah, so see ya. Bye. So it's the next day, I pick up that DVD, long story short, the guy doesn't offer me anything to trade, and he also doesn't use PayPal or Venmo, he doesn't like using cash apps, so I guess he wants me to send it to him as a gift, which Dollar Trees are, uh, they, when they have good DVDs it's a good deal, but me buying other people's DVDs and then paying to ship it to them is not a good deal. 
I know I'm jolly, but sorry, I'm not Santa Claus. <laughs>